Hello, and in this video we shall continue our Linux series by talking about how to install and download a Linux operating system. Now, a couple of disclaimers first off. Uh, um, the distribution that I'm going to be using in all these demonstrations is Ubuntu, and that is the one I'm going to be using in this video. If you don't know what a distribution is, go back and check previous videos because if you haven't already seen them you'll need to, to understand what's go going on in, it, in this video so w with that said I also want to say that in order to show in the screencast the software that I'm going to be using to simulate the computer on which I'm going to be installing this is virtual machine software so what I'm going to show you is a computer booting up in a window in which we're going to install our Linux operating system but in your case just imagine that you're installing it um, on uh, on a computer so here we are the, the, in our case the Ubuntu website here and that's the dish show we're going to be using and we're going to be using the desktop version we want a CD so we're just going to hit this start download button. Once you've done that, what are you going to get? You'll see, over, you'll see over here is an ISO image. Now, I've done previous videos on how to install that. Um, uh, uh, how to make that into a CD because that's basically a CD image that you make into a CD before you use it. Um, so what that's going to give you is a full operating system disk from which you install Linux. There are other other install options, many, many other install options, and I might um go through those at a later date, but today we're just gonna talk about how to actually install Linux. So we're just gonna Minimize that now and pop open the parallels application. So we're going to start the computer and we're starting the computer with that CD ROM inserted. So that will be like if you burned this ISO image that you got off the Ubuntu website to a disk and started your computer with it in. So we're going to boot up the computer.
Linux onto your hard drive. So boot up just like a, a Linux machine. I, I'll be back when this is done because it, it should take quite a while. See you in a minute, guys. Hello, and we're back. Um, we've that installation process has, has finished, and we've got this window that says installation has finished. You, you can now you can now continue testing Ubuntu, but until you restart, any changes will not will not be um shown. Because basically, what we're doing at the moment is off the disk. It's not. It's not the new installation that's actually written to our hard drive. So to use that, we're gonna do a couple of things. We're gonna press the restart now button, and we're gonna remove the disk. So in my case, it says remove the disk and press enter. So. In my case, I'm on my virtual machine here. I'm going to go ahead and disconnect the drive, press enter. And then the next time it boots, it should boot off a new hard drive install. There you go, see, you see how first that booted. We've now got a fully functioning Linux install on our computer. So, thanks for watching this video. I've got much, much more Linux tutorials to come. I hope you've enjoyed it. Please go back and watch uh, the rest of this series if you liked it. And uh, I'll see you in the next video, guys. Thanks for watching.